Good morning, my friends. Well, we're back again. Super bright lights. It's three in the morning, 3.30. We're heading back out. Day two, Ocean City Classic. Day one yesterday was fruitful, but not in the way that we needed. So it was, uh, we caught some fish. Uh, Chris and I got some sheep's head. Chris caught his first tog. We're here, we're getting going. It's not much for me to say at 3.30 in the morning. Still, I'm not a morning person. Captain's log, 6.2599. It's quiet. Too quiet. And the captain is sleeping. Dun, dun, dun. Should we push him over for shark bait? Hoo -ah. Shark bait, hoo -ah. We got donuts. We got chicken. You don't mess with tradition. But I don't know about I don't know about the guy in the back. I don't know if he can hang with us. Stay tuned. Live action coming at you. Dude, these guys over here got like a 33 inch flounder. That's a state record, bro. Dude, look at that flounder. Come out into the light a little bit. There you go. Holy. Dude, that's awesome, dudes. All right, guys, I'd be remiss if I didn't put this picture in here. Uh, the footage that I had was it got messed up from all the moisture on the lens, the catch, and the after. So I showed you what I had, but uh, congratulations to Cleon Atkins. Uh, what an awesome fish here. We were so it was cool being next to them and watching pull this fish in. What a bruiser. 13.2 flounder, y'all. All right, so here we go with uh, my first fish of the day. It was actually only my second bite. So got a 25 inch rock fish. They have to be 28 to 35 to weigh in. And this one's going back. It has been a slow morning. You can see the moisture on the camera still, and it was messing with the audio as well. So uh, yeah. All right, so been a rough go this morning, but it caught a, lot, caught a couple fish. So that's good. Got to start rock fish in the boat. Didn't see that, unfortunately, the camera wasn't rolling, but uh, yeah, it's rough. We got boats all around us. Everybody over here is having a hard time. We got dudes to our left, dudes to our right. These guys just caught that 33-inch flounder, and, uh, but nobody's pulling in fish this morning. Compared to yesterday, everybody was pulling in fish. So it's just a little different today, so we're gonna keep at it. All right, so we've got uh, another. I got another fish on here, and you can see um, how the th how Morgan's working the throttle. So he's watching the line where I'm fighting this fish, and if that fish starts heading towards those pilings, we we, we basically gun it and get it out of there, try to help us pull it out. But uh, man, what a rough morning! I'm gonna tell you right now. Uh, <sighs> We're gonna get this fish in here, and it was just an, it was a blue fish. Wasn't a big deal as far as the tournament, but man, this is the clearest footage I have. I think of this whole day. The camera was crazy. The audio was crazy. Everything seemed to be going wrong. And this is part of YouTube, guys. You just deal with days when things don't go great. You have to salvage footage. So that's what's going on here, but another fish in the boat, another one not on the board. All right, here we go. Another fish. Uh, this time it's going to be a rock fish. And you can tell the difference when these blue fish hit, they peck, 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 and then eat it. Rock fish just attack it. You see Chris pulling us out of there. I said rock fish and more to get me out of there. And uh, boom, there's the net. Again, falling down in front of the lens. Water on the lens. Can't see anything again. I mean, you got to be kidding me with this morning. It was absolutely retarded. And uh, this fish was a 25 inch uh, rockfish. And then they had to be between 28 and 36 to even get on the board. So back he goes. Grow baby. Got my first sheep's head on a bottom sweeper. Check that out. You didn't steal it that time, did you, buddy? Nope. 
All right, catching some fish. That's everybody's got a fish out here. Top two tog and a sheep. We're gonna let him go. Cluster F. It's always a production. Sheep's head over eight inches, right? Hold them up. Over eight inches. That's a big head. That just died right there. Yeah. So I'll tell you what. Pretty excited about that. Black and white stripes. Gorgeous. Boom. Very excited. Chomp, chomp, chomp. Chomp, chomp. Oh, oh, there you go. Chris is on. That's another one, dude. Another nice one. Yep, another nice one. Oh, tog. Sweet. Toggy tog, boat flip. Dude, you gotta get your first keeper tog. I need it. That's not that's not it. <laughs> that is not gonna that's play. not it. Oh, oh Morgan's on. <laughs> Jeez, just like that, y'all. Gonna need a net or you alright? Little tog. Nice one, bro. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh god. That's not that Dude, it wasn't even better. The garage is trying to fiddle with me. Talk to us. Okay. What what do you want to say to the people? Is is, is sophisticated redneckery awesome? Tell your fans. Are they awesome? Oh, well, you keep talking over me, so I don't know what to say. Look at that smile. Dude, he's, listen to him. Dude, they're so cool. We are back at the marina, y'all. Done for the day. That's our two-day haul of keepers. So we did all right. We got these three bad boys right at the end today. Bluefish early. We'd kept those just for weigh-in, and then we bunch of little sheep's head. And then we got some puffer fish. Look, green eyes, blue eyes. What's the difference? Anybody know the difference? I caught them. I don't. I have no idea either. Does anybody comment below why puffer fish have blue eyes versus green eyes? Is there a male-female difference? What is the, what is the answer? Maybe they're wearing contacts. Speaking of contacts, my eyes are really dry. So we're done. We're that was a good. It was you know what? We sucked at the tournament. Do you concur? 
did not win. <laughs> I didn't bring my damn A game. I've been fishing all freaking week since Sunday, so I think I used up all my good mojos in the beginning of the week because I caught a 29 inch rock. Okay, fish, we got 18 minute video. He keeps seems to forget that we have like 15 minutes. I gotta condense all this <laughs> into. Go ahead, have your have your time. Let me just cut my throat. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta give everybody a hard time. It was a good time. I mean, we had a, we had a good time together. Um, tournaments are tough. Everybody out there wants to fish, and it depends on who catches what. And it truly came down to we did not catch any big fish at all. So we're just gonna enjoy our keepers, enjoy our awesome fish here, the haul that we've been blessed with. And uh, hey, we might do this again next year. But always good having the boys around. Chris, yes. thanks for joining. Of course, thank you for having me. And Morgan, as usual. Yeah, you know. Next year, you're not fishing the week before. I don't. I don't plan on even fishing ever again. I think I might retire after this trip. I'm pretty, pretty damn upset with myself. You but heard, hey, it's fishing, not catching. So you heard that right there. He might retire after this video. Y'all want some fishing stuff? Yeah, he's got a lot of fishing stuff to sell. Thanks for joining us, guys. We appreciate it. As usual, if you have not hit that like button down there, do that really quick. And the subscribe button, it means a lot to us. You know the deal. Thanks for following along, and we love you guys. We'll see you in the next one.